apology. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Hunter and I thought I would bring you guys along in my little day in the life. We have some fun things that me and Lake are gonna do together since Zach is working and just thought I'd bring you along. This sweater is such a cute blue color. I'm literally obsessed with it. If it goes in focus, you can see, but anyways, it's like kind of this like deepish tealish color and it's from Anthropology. Apparently Newly has the best anthropology stuff because that's what most of my stuff is. These pants are, I wore them yesterday in my other vlog, but they were in black. These are the green versions. They're also from, guess where? Anthropology. I think they're the brand Maeve. I got my blue Adidas on because I thought blue on blue would be kind of cute. They're not really the same tone, but honestly, I feel like that's kind of a vibe. So we're liking our little fit today. I'm dying. I definitely just changed. <laughs> like most of my outfit you know those days where you're just like i want to look good but then you don't feel good that was just me now i feel good and i just feel more like myself when i'm wearing comfy clothes like this this is my i'm so out of breath from rushing and changing i really need to go honestly i'm running late but i have my daily drill sweater which i'm obsessed with i wear this thing all the time Still got my anthropology pants on, and I really do love them so much. And then I decided to change my shoes and thought a cute little pop of color would be nice. Pink with a little bit of navy, Adidas. Also my favorite shoes in the entire world. And it also gives me a little lift because these pants can get a little bit tall. So feeling better. Now let's go get like up and rush. I try to time out when I leave like perfectly so Lake gets a nap in. I get her up. Let her have fun, eat, and change, and then she can nap on the way to Birmingham because we're in Tuscaloosa, so it's like a little less than an hour. It's nothing crazy, but I didn't time this at all. She's still asleep. <sighs> I have to get her up and then get her changed while she eats at the same time get in the car and go. So we'll see how she goes with that. You know, she used to love road trips, so I feel like now that she's learning how to crawl and move, she's just like, something on my lips now that she's learned how to crawl and like is starting to move around a lot i think she's over like being in one spot so we'll see how this goes pray for me okay we got her all dressed look how cute here's the reveal yeah. look how cute she looks she's got some shoesies on we haven't really been able to find like hold on her sound machine is so loud right now let me turn that off loud we haven't really been able to find shoes that like fit her yet since she was born and so she just kind of wore socks but then zach found these ones at the thrift store and they're ralph Lauren. and they're really nice you talking anyways and then actually he found he found this whole outfit for her the strawberry little suit we're about to leave and i'm gonna see how we're gonna hope and pray that she does good That she does good in the car. When she was eating her milk, she kind of looked like she was trying to fall back asleep. So things are looking hopeful. We are 20 minutes away from Birmingham. It's loud because Lake's using my phone for finding Dory. Because I usually time things. I think I already talked about this earlier, but like I usually time things out better when we go places. And I just did not today, and so she's wide awake. She got her diaper changed. She said she just needed a little bit of entertainment while we're on this drive, and so she's using my phone. And the iPad is like pretty much dead. I was gonna use it for maps, but I just think I'm just gonna have to hope and pray that I know where we're going because it keeps dying. Um, good thing is that where we're going is kind of like you're not in pretty much right around where we used to live. So I think I know where we're going, but I'm also we're just gonna hope and pray for the best. So we made it to Tasty Town. We're just waiting on Nikki to get here, but getting some fresh air. It feels so good outside. It's like definitely springtime is coming or it's here honestly it's like warm but super windy and it feels amazing and i know she's gonna love having some sun in her skin we're gonna like walk around downtown and get her in her stroller it'll be really fun and 
excited. Say hi. <laughs> yeah. hotter than I was expecting outside it was so fun though she loved it she loves the grass like I feel like that's just one thing that we, people don't talk about like watching your kid explore sand grass like she hasn't been to the beach yet and so I honestly don't go outside with her as much as I should and so this is just a reminder that like you can go outside with your baby everything's gonna be okay <laughs> and my friends like she loves nature she loves the beach she loves going outside walking so like anytime we hang out that's what she usually wants to do which is kind of out of my comfort zone a lot because i'm just such a homebody and i'm turning my daughter into a homebody and so going outside with her i was just like oh my god she loves it like it was just a reminder that i need to do that more with her and get her more vitamin d let her explore things other than just like the floor here or like the house like let her explore grass and the beach and like yeah anyways it was just encouraging and also a good reminder and she is out she literally slept on the way home and then i got her up changed her because she pooped a lot and i thought she was gonna want to stay up no she was so cranky i laid her down immediately went to sleep so i'm going to just chill and embrace the quiet house right now until she wakes up I need a little pick me up Cheers <laughs> 